Alright, let's head into another boss fight. Moon, Shine, Mob, and Bootlegger Boogie. Alright, welcome. We're trying to fight the, um, the Bootleg Boogie crew, or something like that. I don't know. Here's what I do with those black bombs. I walk into them, and then I walk away. That way you know they're not going to hit you. Here's another strategy. Don't stand near the edges of this fight, because those guys are going to come out and poke out of the walls and do that poison gas. There he goes. So you don't want to be right near the edge, because they will pop out on top of you. I've seen it happen, sadly, one too many times. He calls friends, so don't get hit by him, by the way. He calls friends, so you're going to want to shoot them to death, but if you let them leave, that's another strategy to deal with them. I'm going to pop those just so we don't get hurt, and we're going to shoot this guy with a new lightning shot. It's very useful. Don't get hit by the caterpillar. It's not good for your health. Oh, we killed him. That's pretty easy. Let's do some tracer shots. I like to just focus on dodging. That's why I use the tracer sometimes. Okay, we're going to shoot this lady next. And the main strategy here is green lines are okay, yellow lines are okay, but they're about to be... Oh, I walked into her. They're about to be not okay. So walk away from the yellow lines if you can, and don't walk into the boss either. It's a pretty good strategy, but I've devised all on my own. I know, it's a pretty novel idea. Okay, you want to take out the ads. Oh, we're going this way now with the yellow lines. There's um, there's a video online, probably more than one, but um, it had like scrapped Cuphead ideas or ideas that were still in the files or something for Cuphead. And these colored lines that change into dangerous colored lines was one of those um, featured in the video. So I want to thank my small child for watching that video 20 times a day because I knew exactly what to do when I saw these lines. It didn't help me live the first time I saw the lines. But I did know exactly what to do, so that's that's helpful in its own way. Okay, we got her. The last phase is like a snail anteater combo. It actually, I don't know who to hit. I know to hit the snail when he's not under the hat. Um, but I'm using the chaser. Okay, so we hit the nose. So it's hitting towards the nose. Okay, I didn't realize that. We have our special. Let's use the Miss Chalice special as soon as this guy goes a little crazy. Don't come near me, you sicko. Um, the Miss Chalice special is a vertical uh, cylinder of pain, just like Cuphead's is a horizontal cylinder of pain. So we want to wait... Oh, well, I fat-fingered that. But that's alright, we don't need that. So we want to hit the nose. Interesting. Oh, we got him! Okay, so there you go. What the hell? They were, like, humping that sign. That was strange. Oh, no. Oh, no, we're not dead. We're not alive. I thought this only had three phases. Okay. I thought the knockout looked weird. Okay, there it goes. All right, so don't get tricked at the end. There you go. That's how you beat the snail, the spider, and the anteater and spider. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is going to be an A++. Miss Chalice, a great character. Pretty close. Anyway, that'll do it for the tips and tricks. I hope this helped a little bit. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. I hope this video helped out in some way. If so, please leave a like. If you enjoyed this video, Subscribe if you want to see more Cuphead and other video game videos, and leave a comment on what helped out best in this video. Thank you for watching, and have a great day. And remember, don't deal with the devil.